Dilly in the body snatcher right here. It's a champ. Big up the sport tonight. Come and subscribe. Otherwise, I might pay you guys a visit. Right, so a bit of boxing news for you all. As a result, Robert Hellenius knocks out Erkin Tepper. Now, for those of you who may not be too familiar with who these guys are, now, Robert Hellenius, he got beaten by Dylan White um, in a, not a great fight where uh, Robert Hellenius, um, he started off quite well, but then kind of like went into retreat or survival mode against Dylan White. And Robert Hellenius was once pitched as the next Vladimir Klitschko to replace Vladimir Klitschko for like big guy, big Viking kind of guy. And with some pretty decent power as well. And Erkan Tepper, he's from Germany. He's been done on a couple of occasions for PEDs. Or at least it's a couple of occasions, I think it is. One of them for sure, which is when uh, he knocked out David Price in two rounds. Where David Price got hit and he fell into the corner of the ring and laid there out cold. That's Erkan Tepper. Very, very big puncher. 19 wins, 12 of those by knockout. Well, Robert Hellenius went to Germany to Erkan Tepper's home country. And sparked him out cold in eight rounds. He hit him with a left hook, followed by a left uppercut, and Erkan Tepper went down, stayed down. And this was for the IBF Intercontinental Heavyweight title as well. So, Robert Hellenius, he has had a couple of wins since that Dylan White loss, where um, um, against some guy, um, I can't even pronounce his name to be honest with you, um, where he beat him, then he had a rematch with him and beat him again, both times on points. But he gets hold of Erkan Tepper who has a bit of a reputation of starching people. And Robert Hellenius put him out cold. If you put him out cold. And, and as I said, this is in the home country of Erkan Tepper in Germany. So congratulations to Robert Hellenius. Which goes to show that, uh, you see, a lot of people were trying to pour cold water on Dylan White beating Robert Hellenius. But as I said to you guys, when that fight was happening on the build-up to it, that Robert Hellenius is a serious, serious contender. He's got all the tools in the world. He really has. Just that um, against Dylan White, he went into retreat mode. And I think it's a case of he was m maybe confident before he got in with Dylan White. But once he realized that Dylan White is actually bigger and stronger than first perceived, he went into retreat mode and survived the rest of the fight. And it's very difficult to fight somebody when they're just being defensive the entire fight on the back foot and keep on running away. You know, it this kind of thing happens the world over in boxing. This is why Floyd Mayweather is so difficult to beat because he goes into retreat mode virtually the entire fight, but he throws enough punches to win the rounds. And Robert Hellenius, he went to Germany and starched out Erkan Tepper, where maybe Erkan Tepper may have been the favourite for this fight, to be fair. So, yeah. Robert Hellenius is back in contention for potentially a world title shot in the not too distant future. Of course, it won't be just yet because uh, for the IBF, you've got Huey Fury going up against Kubrat Pulev on the 27th of October there in Sofia in Bulgaria. But yeah, Robert Hellenius isn't too far behind now and he'll be ranked within the IBF now. So anyway, congratulations to Robert Hellenius. Gets a knockout victory over Erkan Tepper. You drop your thoughts below, click that thumbs up and subscribe. Catch you all on the next video.